Welcome to this episode of TRK TV. We are racing today at Tarapa. Got a big card in, but let's start with Wide Awake in race two with Matthew Cameron aboard. Yeah, his run wasn't probably as bad as it looked at uh, at Tarapa last time. Um, sort of got back, but his sectionals were still okay, even though he finished near the tail of the field. So he's been doing a bit of jumping. Um, we need to see him step up uh you know, at Tarapa, but we think he can. Right, and fabulous flight in race two with Craig Grills aboard. Yeah, he's just had no luck his last couple of starts and um, was lucky to stay on his feet at Tiaraho last week. So but he's, he's on the back up before the track's deteriorate. This will be his, his last run before he goes out for a break, but we think he's certainly up to it and going to develop into a nice cup sort of horse for next year. All right, and Bo Jest in a race three with Troy Harris. Yeah, he won his maiden well, albeit a high weight at Taranaki last time. Uh, he'll go forward from the barrier, and uh, we're looking forward to seeing how he can handle the step up and grade. And in a race for Kings Guard with Chelsea Burden aboard. Yeah, won well last time at uh, Ellerslie. Um, just sort of stepping up and trip 1400. Um, Claim again, race handy to the speed, and uh, it'll be interesting to see how he goes back left handed. We certainly. Uh, think that he might be a little bit better right-handed, um, but this was sort of the most suitable race for him, so we're looking forward to seeing how he goes back left-handed. And race six, two runners, the first being Burgundy Bell and uh, with Troy Harris aboard. Yeah, Burgundy, I'm pleased with her. She trialled well at uh, Avondale the other day. This is uh, sort of lead into the um, Cambridge Brady Stakes in a couple of weeks. She's got a good record, should run well. First start with blinkers off, um, just sort of changing around a little bit of gear there to see if we can just get her to switch off a little bit. And uh, penultimate in race six with Craig Grills. Yeah, tried very well at uh, Avondale. She's going well. She's two from two and looking forward to seeing how she can step, handle the step up and grade to the three-year-old company on Sunday. And race eight has Quattro Katie with Craig Grills aboard. Yeah, pleased with her. She won well last time at Made a Minute and uh, I think she's improved a little bit at home. So, you know, up to 65 grade uh, is never easy, but um, she's drawn nicely. Should be a good each-way chance. All right, and so that's... a Pretty big lineup of runners. Do you have a best bet? Quattro Caddy should be nice each with a price at Tura. A good Sunday ahead of racing. Good luck to all our owners and connections.